Hello? Hello? What's going on? Hi, y'all. So, we're back at it again, you know, doing our food ventures, but just something new to the scene. Right. So, we're at this place called Pythagoras. It's a vegan spot. Oh, it's level five vegan. That means that it's the highest level of veganism. Heard. So, everything looks so good. Honestly, the menu is like one, two, three, four, wait, one, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight, eight pages of what right. looks amazing. amazing. We I ordered a jalapeno um, mint margarita and some um what are they wings. called? The wings. The wings are bone in, but it's the bone is sugar cane. So we're gonna see how that goes. We ordered buffalo sauce, garlic sweet chili sauce, and Parmesan garlic butter. So we're gonna try that. It's half a dozen, right? Yes. Thank you. Thank you. I just realized they were too much. We're good. Thank you. I actually have a question for you. Um, which are the, um, what has soy in it as far as like the pizza toppings? Um, pepperoni, bacon, and the chicken. The chicken has soy. Okay. The sausage is soy. The sausage is the sausage. Okay, so sausage is Alright, thank you so much. So yeah, y'all hear him asking about this soy because um, apparently soy is bad for testosterone. Yep, levels in there. So try to avoid it as much as possible, especially for men. Um, however, because it, it actually increases estrogen levels. So that's why it's bad. But I'm about to get my estrogen popping in this mug, okay? So yeah, I think that I'm gonna get this reptilian agenda pizza. Y'all know I'm a spicy queen, and on the menu it literally says hot as hell right next to it. So I'm gonna get that. It has um, house made spicy marinara with red chili peppers, house mozzarella blend, fresh jalapenos, pickled jalapenos, banana peppers, onions, hot Italian sausage, pepperoni, and topped with pep pepperoncini. I don't know what that is, but a about to smack the hoe, okay. Come in soon. Have you decided? Yep, yep, yep. I think I'm gonna do Jesse's grass. Jesse's grass? What Jesse's does that have grass. on it? It is your choice of crust, house marinara, house mozzarella, spinach, sweet peas, mushrooms, cherry tomatoes, onions, bell peppers, banana peppers, black olives, all top of fresh arugula, and parmesan garlic, extra virgin olive oil drizzle. Wow. Chef's so face. So our wings are coming soon. I just got my margarita. Let's look at her. Ooh, she looks good. So let me taste this for y'all. Fire. Fire got like the chili salt in the room. It has jalapenos and mint and lime floated in it. It's pretty good. But we will catch back up with y'all when our wings hit the table. Yes, See you uh, soon. Peace. All right, trying these wings. Try and play first. Playing. What you thinking? What you thinking? Have a nice part. Great All right, now dip it, dip it. Try which sauce you trying? The sweet chili. This is the sweet chili. Garlic sweet chili. Garlic sweet yeah. chili. Sorry. Mm. Good. Mm. Very good. I think this is what is that? That's probably not garlic. Parmesan garlic butter. Where? Ranch and buffalo, buffalo. sauce. Cool. All right, my turn. Uh, we got Lexi B in the mix. She's picking up her wing. I'm gonna try it. She tried it raw. Right. Bruh. It got like some type of smoky taste behind it. Mm -hmm. And I'm not a fan of smoky, but this is good. Oh, it was. It now was. I'm gonna try buffalo because y'all know me. I love buffalo. Spicy McQueen.
You know it could always be spicier. I'm back. Okay, I'm gonna try this garlic, garlic parmesan ball. butter. Got a little oil on it. Go crazy. I can't really taste it to me. Yeah, it just tastes like oil. Sweet chili. Sweet chili is fine. That and the ranch is my favorite. It's good. It's different. Like Asian wing and buffalo wing, buffalo right. wild wing, and then the ranch. Like ranch. I know it's good. I'm not gonna hold y'all. I had to crash that celery. Yeah. Overall review. And this is sugar cane. It's not sweet. It tastes like the wing. You feel me? So it definitely tastes like the wing. I'm about to crash this with this buffalo sauce, so y'all know me. All right, y'all. See y'all for the main entree. Peace. Real quick, y'all. I just have to talk about this earthgasm I've been getting because they, first of all, don't hand out straws. Um, you know, plastic kills the and all that other stuff. That jazz, good jazz. But the straws that they do hand out are sustainable paper straws that look like from afar, and they're like brown. This brown color. This place is just so cute. Look at the TVs and stuff behind me. It's just so cute. Love it. 10 out of 10. Recommend. All right, y'all. The food is here. It's time to dig in. See what they're talking about. They said they made my, my pizza extra, extra, extra spicy. But, you know, every day, every day. So, I'm going to go ahead and put these crushed red peppers on this, on this grill. <laughs> Boom, straight like that. I know he wants some. I know you already got some. He, they gave us separate pressure and everything. And then we ordered some parmesan, which he's about to get right. You want some parmesan? Yeah, so I can crack that. Well, maybe I ain't done it in a while. Thank okay. you. Thank you. Yeah, so I'm gonna put a little extra parm on it. We also got Parmesan garlic crust. But you know, you can never be too much Parmesan. There you go. I don't ever get Parmesan on my pizza no more, so I might as well take the opportunity, right? So while I'm sipping this, I'm gonna let him do that, and then you wanna taste it? Or you gonna wait? Yeah, I don't know. Just, you said the plate is really hot, not the pizza. I mean, I'm assuming both of them. You're about to see that. Glory to God. Mm -hmm. Mm -hmm. Mm -hmm. Mm -hmm. Mm -hmm. Ten out of ten. Remember the last time he gave that place like a six and a half. Yeah, this is what do. All right, all right, my turn. Got me. Spicy queen. Oh my god. Uh oh. What you think? It can always be spicier. I'm I'm put this buffalo sauce on it. I think that's gonna tip it over the edge for me. This is fire though. Say I'll what? say 9.5 out of 10. Just because nobody can be perfect with my spice levels. So, fire though. We all here your first, y'all. We're about to see y'all later. Peace. <sighs> Alright, y'all. So last thing. We finished the pizza. You know me. I got a tiny stomach. Spicy Queen, tiny stomach. So, finished the pizza, got mine boxed up, and we ordered some baklava. We'll do maybe a little video on some of the foods that we eat that aren't so well known. Um, baklava being one of them, but very, very, very good dish. Now, if you're allergic to nuts, I would not recommend at all. At all. Um, Please don't. It'll kill you. But for those nut eating. <laughs> I would definitely recommend it. It's so, so, so good. So we ordered the Persian baklava. And um, here is what it looks like. Now that's just a small piece of it. This is about how big it is in general. Um, this is how much I'm going to eat because my tummy is tucking, okay? I got these waist beads. And the waist beads be eating, getting ate up. That's when I know I need to stop eating. So that's how much I'm going to eat. Let me see. Let me try it. All right. So exciting. 
Okay. So, it is very good, but it would definitely be better if it was warm. But it is really, really good. It's crazy good. Yeah. So, overall, what do you give this this restaurant a rating of? Yeah. Y'all heard him last time. It's been a little rough on the people before, but I would also give it a 10. 10 out of 10 recommend. Y'all gotta hit Pythagoras if you come to Houston. If you live in Houston, hit Pythagoras. Even if you're not vegan, the stuff does not even taste vegan for real. It tastes really, really, really good. So go ahead and come through here. Oh, also, real quick, these earthgasms I told y'all about earlier, I got the straw. It's like it's it's not a paper straw. I don't know what it is, but it feels like it's tough, like bamboo type. So I'm 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 guessing that it might be a bamboo straw. I'm gonna ask though, because I don't know. You know, paper straws, they melt and everything, but it's like, it's really tough, so. Hey. Come in here, y'all. Come in here. But hold on, y'all. We just got this. <laughs> he done crashed. <laughs> he done crashed down here the whole thing. This man loves to eat, though. All right, all right, all right. <laughs> um, that's Lexi and the That's Dean. Lexi's move. Make sure you like, comment, share, subscribe, all that good sh And we'll see y'all next time. Bye. All right, y'all, real quick, I have to give a quick update. So I asked the waitress what the straws are made out of. Agave. She said they melt in hot water, which I'm assuming, like, they probably make tea and they put the straws in there or something, and it'll, you know. Get a little razzle dazzle, but I got that. Was not thinking that. Was not thinking that at all. But they're tough. So, yeah. Just I, all I can say is all I can keep saying is bring that here, y'all. Bring that. Here. All right. We'll see y'all next time for real. For real. Bye.